Welcome, children. I was excited to see, as I was driving in to uh, record this, uh, children playing in the playground. So excited to have you back on campus and to school. And uh, so this week, just like last week, I'll record two uh, worship services, really tiny uh, chapel times for your preschool. And uh, I'll sing a song, but you're not supposed to sing it with me, and you probably don't know it anyway. Um, but uh, I'll sing to you, and then I'll also give a lesson for you. So we begin our service in the name of the Father, who is the head, in the name of the Son, who is the heart, in the name of the Holy Spirit, who are the hands and feet of God. The song is called, How Great Thou Art. because of all the things that he made in the world. And it talks in that particular verse about the stars, the rolling thunder, and uh, the universe itself. And so I have something to show you. It's a painting. And it was painted by a lady who's over 90 years old. And uh, the painting is kind of blurry. The reason it's kind of blurry is because she saw the world in a blurry kind of way. She was actually legally blind when she painted this, um, but she painted it to the best she could uh, from her own memory and from the fact that she saw things in a blurry kind of way. And so because she saw that the world that way, that's the way she painted the world. And you can see the stream running through the forest here, and, uh, and that's a, a beautiful example of God's creation. So even though she couldn't see perfectly, actually she saw the world really through a very blurry eyes, um, she had this saying, and that we, she said that we walk by faith and not by sight. And so uh, I have that saying next to this particular painting in my home uh, because she was a person of faith and, uh, and she saw God's creation in a beautiful kind of way, even though it came out kind of blurry. Uh, so I always treasure this uh, painting because it's not only showing uh, how God's world is created, but how it was seen through her through these blurry eyes. So thank you for coming to chapel, and uh, we'll close by praying the Lord's Prayer. So fold your hands and bow your heads. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. My children, we'll see you at the next video. <laughs>